Rudy, welcome back to Glasgow Warriors. How does it feel to be back at Scotland? Yeah, it's really nice to be fair. It's, um, yeah, I feel fairly at home. It's uh, obviously the stadium and change rooms and everything, trying to find a new spot. But, um, but yeah, everything else feels, feels pretty good. A lot of new young faces, um, but some, some nice old, old faces as well that uh, it's been good to catch up with. How's the last three years been for you, being away playing in the English Premiership? Yeah, it's been awesome. Uh, I've absolutely loved it down there. New experiences, uh, new grounds, just new competition. It's been, it's been really good fun and I've been, been lucky to be part of Well, certainly had a good bit of success at Wasps. Uh, we were pretty close to, to a good couple of, uh, couple of years, but it's been, uh, it's been awesome experiences and uh, I'm really excited about coming back here though and, and getting stuck in again. Do you feel you've come back a better player for the experience? Yeah, definitely. I've, I've been lucky enough to work with some great coaches, some great players and I feel I've definitely learned a lot and, and uh, ex the experiences that I've had and certainly some, some of the big games and that, certainly that Wasps year. Um, I definitely feel that I've come back a better player, a more rounded player and uh, a few more years in the bank and a bit of experience. So um, hopefully that should send me in good stead and yeah, I just want to keep, keep on improving now that I'm, now I'm up here and, and want to do my best for Glasgow. What are you looking forward to most about being back? Uh, I'm definitely excited about a Friday night game at Scotston, that's for sure. Um, they're always great fun, the atmosphere's uh, always buzzing and uh, under the lights, so it should, should, should really be good. Um, definitely one of the things I'm looking forward to most. When it was announced, all the supporters were very happy that you were coming back. You must have had <laughs> lots of messages from people on social media and text messages. Yeah, it was, it was a really nice um, reaction. Um, a, a lot of nice messages on, on Twitter, Instagram and stuff like that. So. That's always nice. Um, <laughs> they, they maybe have missed me a little bit, so it's good. So hopefully hope I can keep, keep on their good sides and putting some good performances for them and repay that, that sort of faith that they, they're putting in me. New coaching team here, Dave Rennie coming in. How much are you looking forward to working with them? Yeah, it'll be awesome. I mean, uh, Dave's obviously comes from a fairly good stock um, over in New Zealand um, with the Chiefs. Been very successful there. So I think it'll be, it'll be really good once he, he gets in here. I think on Monday will be his first day. And so it'll be, I think guys will be sort of eager to impress and a bit on edge, um, trying, to, trying to get to grips with him and finding out how, how he really works and operates. So it'll be, be really good fun. But I think the continuity that's been brought in with the likes of, like Kenny's obviously still here and Mike from last year. Um, and also Jason uh, Holmes knows a lot of the guys as well. And I think that's a good balance to have sort of uh, Dave will have his ideas and philosophies, but to have, have a bit of a transition, I think, will be uh, stand the squad in good stead. And do you see yourself predominantly as a fly half? <laughs> we'll, we'll see what Dave has to say about it. But um, yeah, I think so. Uh, it's where I really like to play. It's my favourite position. But I mean, I'm, I'm happy to do my bit for the team. So if that's, that involves playing in a different position, full, full back predominantly, maybe. But um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll play, play wherever, but hopefully it's uh, more, more in the 10 position. And two new South African teams coming into what is now the Guinness Pro 14, so slightly different to what you were used to before? Yeah, exactly. It's going to, going to be a little bit different. Uh, used to the sort of away days and travelling about, but it's going to be a slightly longer journey this time. Um, I think it's going to be awesome. I think um, having that sort of different dimension to, to the tournament, sort of new structure and everything, it, it makes it really exciting. And, and I think everyone's just desperate to get stuck in and it will be uh, a new experience for a lot of guys playing out in South Africa. Um, so it'll be, and also, normally we, whenever we play them, we'll be in their in their winter. So to to play in their summer could be a, t a tough shift for some of the boys. But it's uh, it's something that everyone's really really looking forward to and gearing up for.